come back to random chicas and hills i have stella my maggie. friends here <laughs> maggie stella <laughs> this is maggie this is stella so you guys hmm today actually over the weekend i went to the salon to do my hair as you can see my hair looks so bushy and a bit yeah. disorganized so i planned on you know going to the salon to work on it but what happened to me when I got there was unimaginable. <laughs> it was too much. So I got to work this morning and I was telling these guys about it. And they had hilarious stories to share about their salon moments. So we are going to share all our salon experiences. And I hope you have stories too. I don't know, things you've, you know, gone through when you go to salons. So let's go into it. <laughs> So you guys i went to the salon to do my hair so i get there i had this fancy you know hairstyle in my head i had the pictures i got in everything from pinterest you know i'm ready to show this salon lady what i want mm -hmm. so mm -hmm. <laughs> this lady both they tells me we are not going to do that so i was like excuse me what are you waiting for do it just do it! She's like, no, we are not doing that hairstyle on you. It's not good for people who have round faces. It's not... So she started giving me options of things I don't want to do. So I'm showing her I know what I want to do in my hair. I know. But the lady insisted, no, we are not going to do that to your hair. Because according to her, mm. she prefers certain kinds of hairstyles on people that have like natural mm -hmm. hair. So you guys, I sit and I'm thinking, okay, let's do threes. We actually tried it out. Like, let's do threes. I want, like, the first, don't start from the skin. You should do a little, like, plate some bit of the skin and then finish up the strand. So she starts and she's doing the opposite. She's doing, like, a pencil. Like, in Uganda, a pencil is, I think, cornrows. <laughs> a cornrow, that's We call it a, like an actual pencil. Is that what you call what? <laughs> no, cornrows are called pencil. Cut was a pencil, right? Yeah, yeah. But now it's pencil. Like, oh, excuse just, me, it's pencil. Okay, pencil. <laughs> now it's pencil. Right? But the right thing <laughs> okay. is corners. Anywho, mm -hmm. I argued with this lady until I just gave up. I was like, you know what? Remove your things. Let me just go home. Like <laughs> just like that. I'm still looking for a salon that can do the hair that I want without refusing to do it. So guys, have you had a uh, salon experience? No, it's just <laughs> wow. us. Why yours is better? I just don't know. Yours, I, I don't know. Anyways, maybe I'm just extreme, but so you guys, I go to do pedicure sometime. You know, the things like your nails are so chapped, you've been going through like the struggles we've been going through. <laughs> so I go, and then this guy is what? Working on my nails. He cuts them well. I tell him I want box shape. You know, they always have like different shapes. Uh -huh. So I want box shape. He's like, okay. <laughs> then. You know, they first have to scrub the, the what, the feet, feet. the nails, remove the, the split ends of the cuticle, fail. So he's putting, a, you know, that scrub on the legs. On the legs, yeah? Doesn't the guy go beyond the knees? <laughs> <laughs> I was like, Jesus, what's happening? What was he doing? I was like, did some, I, I wish someone had So next thing me. you know, someone was, was in my thighs. It's like, not in the thighs. You guys, I'm like, I just, I just asked like, yo, what's <laughs> happening? <laughs> Are you running? Why are you running? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Like what's happening? I look at him. I'm like, yo, what's up? Uh -huh. Like I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Then he tries to clean them out. Then he he what? That's just like the beginning of my problems. Then I I ask for a color that I wanted that he didn't have it, and I think he had it in girl. Now you know, girl needs you to put that machine, and then it dries and all that. So I tell the man, I'm like, okay, I need this color. He doesn't tell me it's girl. I, I he puts on the what the the polish. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I wait for thirty minutes. It seems, is it girl or gel? It's gel or gel or gel. gel. Okay. <laughs> Anywho, moving on. <laughs> I know she will not let you prosper. <laughs> so, so, so that gel, uh, I put the polish. Uh, then I wait for thirty minutes and then. He's like, oh, your nails are good. Oh, so you thought it was no more vanish. No more vanish. That should have dried on. on. Yes. Should oh, have dried oh. like in 30 minutes. 30 minutes was long. Oh, yeah. And then I go home. 
and then you know how you sit on your feet and then they feel a bit sticky 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 stick they're sticking on your clothes I'm like, maybe i took maybe it was quite a short time maybe you put such a thick layer i go and shower i sleep in the morning removing them that i stick on my precious <laughs> And then it stayed, then after that I had to put like colorless, I was like, there's no, I'm going back to this hassle. I just put colorless and moved on. You put it afresh. But that time, my money won't go to waste. I was also thinking, I have to say, but then he'll give you a different color that you also don't want. And then you know, you know how those guys take things so emotionally. And then removing the gel is another process. It's another process and it's long. You will remove it if I've paid you. But now... I was going to go then like I could spoil your nails and he's already scrubbed them, he's you know smooth. Okay, I, yeah, I, I know, I know, I know. It's just like right. you know, let's progress with life. The struggle is real. I'm sorry you had to go through that. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Do you have a story to share? <laughs> Stella. Mine. Stella. Mine was during lockdown. So my sister in law has a sister in Rwanda. And that chick has like someone who plates their hair so nicely, mm-hmm. like you know that mm-hmm. those nice corners, you know, and yeah, yeah, yeah. mm-hmm. the nice corners. So this chick connects us to her Ugandan sister, for she's this side. Who has so we are like, yeah, she's corner like, oh, skills, okay. yeah. Apparently, she's the one who even taught the sister in Chigali. Oh, okay. <laughs> so we, she's good. Hmm? She's really good. So we, uh huh. We get in contact with this chick. Chick stays nasa, no? Okay, mm-hmm. pass nasa. Na. Yeah, We are like, okay, you see, that is very far. At least come closer to town. And you know, during lockdown, mm-hmm. Chick is like, okay, I'll come closer to town, but then there's this guy who needs to take me back. So it needs to be around Makere Chikoni. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. We are like, okay, it will, maybe it's a nice place. You get it. Me and my sister woke up, dressed up. Went for this salon chick, thinking we are going to a nice place. You people, <laughs> she took us to a, a garage. <laughs> you know, a ghetto garage in front. <laughs> Was it too ghetto, ghetto, ghetto? You know what is lower than ghetto? <laughs> it's ghetto. It's ghetto level one. I think um, like it's beyond slum, slum. Yeah. But you know, okay. perfect. The ladies that do really good hairstyles mm. usually live and in such those, places. Those. No, so she actually to... hired out a place for us to oh, plate really? us. Yeah. It was like, is it called a lodge? Yeah, that is not a lodge. <laughs> you feel, because we climbed stairs, which are metallic and they are shaky. And then to get up there, the room was so small. It had like a bathroom which is open. Yeah, like she's. I think Boda Boda guys take girls there or something. <laughs> <laughs> It was horrible. We are like, we are not sitting here. Yeah, I know, it was like, just too much fun. What if someone finds us there? Oh, because you want perfect. But they perfect, do. Yeah. I know they really do nice hair. Yeah. Okay, so, we're not judging people that come from there. I know, but, but we're just telling her. Actually, we want to have the nice hair still. Yeah. So, she, she finally fixes us another place. A casaloon around. Oh, that's where you went to do mm, your hair. went there. You guys. Yeah. Chic was painful when she was plating. Uh. Painful. The perfect lady moved yeah, from perfect, perfect to painful. 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 <laughs> you know, painful. And these people who put your head in their thighs, like, oh, their so you had to like, sit and then oh, sit in her shoes. I know that, like, corners. you sit and then put she wants you to your head in her thighs. <laughs> I couldn't wait for that. Don't wait. <laughs> I kept the hair for three months. I know, oh. man, at that point, <laughs> three months. It's, it has like, to be after all this. I pain. feel you like yo. It has to be I did the whole know. three months rest from my head. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> there are those times when someone really pulls you, like even you know, you washing your face. Yeah, yeah, yeah. First of all, washing your face is <laughs> painful, so you wash your face like this. How about sleeping? Like, how do you sleep with your hair all pulled out? So you start sleeping with makeup on. <laughs> <laughs> But you're not being in that chick's thighs, you guys. <laughs> no. I know that thighs. Oh, yes. Oh, guys. The time I went to wash my hair, and mm. you still little ladies. You need to, you know, hygiene is key. Oh, my God. Diora is your friend. Oh, my God. So, you guys, this lady was washing my head. At, look at my hair. At the sink. But, yo, I mean, it should do this, eh? Like, the moisture oh was ah. just killing me. I'm like, yeah, I smell good. Like, Madame, 
tayo. <laughs> so I kept on pulling. <laughs> like, <laughs> you like, your pulling or pushing. pushing like, I like, hold my breath, then like exhale, then try to move away. And then she's pulling it back. Ah! Thank you for watching. Um, if you have any stories mm-hmm. to share, any experiences, please share in the comment section below. Yeah. And say hi to these beauties. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to subscribe. Yep. Keep watching the random babes, the random chicas. chicas. Thank you. We love you.